hi and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new if you are new and you like makeup beauty hair or holes then please consider subscribing so for today's video i have a look fantastic haul it's all in this box here it's been a while since i've done like a sit down haul i was thinking about it the other day and i thought i used to do like revolution ones uh k beauty ones uh, look fantastic all the time and i don't know why no reason i just haven't done one for ages so the first item i picked up is this here now i thought this was a really good deal and when i saw this i thought what an absolutely perfect christmas gift i can say that word now surely we're nearly in november um but yeah it's the um the cloud perfume from ariana grande which i know is really popular because it smells absolutely amazing i've never had it before but i went to uh superdrug presents gosh that was a while ago now and they had uh, an Ariana Grande uh, fragrance stand and I smelt it and it was so nice and I did kind of you know say to myself I would pick it up in the future but this was such a good deal I had to try it so this cost what was this 34 pounds I want to say I'll link everything down below that I show but look what you get inside so you've got the full-sized perfume here which i didn't even realize but it's the cutest thing so it comes in a little stand most people are looking at this thinking oh, i know that claire but i didn't i didn't have a clue so yeah we get this little like cloud stand here and then the perfumes inside and how much is in this one yeah 30 mil in here right so bearing in mind this is 34 pounds and this is just so cute i'm gonna give it a sniff oh it does it smells so good it actually reminds me of another more high-end perfume it's probably supposed to be some kind of a dupe for that or a lot of people have said it already but yeah i as i say it's only the first time i've got it so um yeah if you know let me know because it will bug me um but also in here there's like a little travel size one as well and there's quite a lot in here so you get this one and how there's 10 mil in here so in total you get 40 mil of fragrance for 34 pounds which is so good and the box is really cute as well and then i picked up this here i've wanted to try this for absolutely ages it's been in my basket for months i think and uh, yeah i finally picked it up so this was 29 pound 50 and this is the color wow money mist uh lux light leaving conditioner for glossy expensive looking hair so uh yeah it's uh, 150 mil in here and i'm really excited to try this actually i've been trying to really kind of up my hair care routine you know with when washing it and products and things like that and i have seen a difference i've still got you know the short if you haven't seen me before you won't know but i basically i went to a hairdresser she put on a really strong like coloring product well it was it wasn't a bleach it was a high lift i normally have bleach before she said it would be better and it basically took out half my hair which was nice so um yeah i've been sort of sticking extensions in at the front here they're only up to about there there's nothing at the back uh just to kind of disguise it but in the meantime while i'm trying to grow it back with those in i um yeah i've been using all sorts like k18 um oh the way gloss is so good as well it's really good um but yeah i thought i'd try this as well and the color wow um you know the original spray as well i've been using that as a, a heat protectant so yeah i will be trying this out very very soon well the next time i wash my hair i only washed it last night so it'll be a few days um yeah and i'll let you know how i get on also picked up this l'oreal revite what is it revitalift filler hyaluronic acid uh anti-wrinkle eye serum i've seen so many people use this i think it went pretty much viral on tiktok at one point um as things tend to do and yeah i kept saying to myself oh i need to try it i need to try it and i've tried the the face serum and it's really good like really good so i can't see why this would be any different but yeah two two and a half percent hyaluronic acid and caffeine i do like caffeine for my under eyes i usually use the inky list one and it is so good really good works nice under makeup as well 
and then I also picked up this foundation which is quite new from Maybelline the Superstay 30 hour Lumi matte foundation looking at it now I don't know if I've picked up a bit too dark a shade but we'll see uh yeah I'll pop this into some kind of review video soon um but yeah I'm really excited to try that I've heard really good things about it and that was £10.39 oh the this I didn't say was £16.99 then I picked this up which I was very excited to try or am very excited to try the Iconic London Translucent Setting Powder this is quite new it's only been out I want to say about a month the Velvet Blur Translucent Setting Powder and it's one of the ones that's got like a little sifter in it so we've got our sort of usual beautiful iconic london mirrored packaging and then in here we have a beautiful puff actually that's really nice so we've got a little puff i do love a puff and then here i'm not going to open it just yet because um i'm going to review this very soon as well but it's got what i believe we've got like a little sifter here and then all the powder in the bottom here but again i've heard really good things about this there's 10 grams of powder in here that doesn't sound like a lot. What's normally in the pack? Let's have a look at my other one. I mean, this is a K Beauty one. Oh, 15 grams. It's not that much difference, I suppose. I don't know what's in like the Laura Mercier ones and things. I haven't got one on me. I think it's in my drawers. But yeah, uh, this was £20. But yeah, I'm really excited to try this out because as I say, I have heard amazing things about it. I'm starting to get back into powders again lately. I didn't wear them for ages. Um, but yeah, obviously, you know, getting older and things, my pores are getting larger and I like to kind of, you know, just just hide them a little bit with a bit of powder so i also picked up this and um, this is the ysl make me blush uh, liquid blush you've probably seen that really pale uh, lilac shade that you know doesn't show up on my skin tones i've seen it on one girl and it looked absolutely stunning on her but i think she's got like um is it al albino where it, the the hair's like almost white and she's partially sighted but she's got really really pale skin and it looked absolutely stunning on her but everyone else you know I don't think I've seen anyone else try it and like it however I picked up this shade here which looks absolutely stunning so this one is 44 nude lavelier or lavelier um, but yeah I just love the packaging look at this but do you know what I will say that the packaging does seem kind of cheaper than I would expect from a YSL product looking at it this looks like frosted glass which I've got a few other other products that are frosted glass like I think I've got an Amani foundation but this is plastic it's frosted plastic which and the lid even doesn't seem as good quality as i would expect from a product like this you know this was 33 pounds so you at least want the the packaging to be decent quality i think but yeah the doe foot is like this so it's kind of like a bit of um a diamond can you see that and then it's got one of those little pockets that picks it up i'll do it i'll do a tiny swatch but again i want to put this into a first impressions so yeah that's what it's like so yeah I mean, it's it's pretty. I've put it on probably the hairiest part of my arm, so it's clinging to the hairs. But yeah, it is pretty. I think this is going to be quite a kind of a subtle shade, but that's what I was going for. So that is absolutely fine. There was a darker pink and um, like a more coral shade as well. Uh, I have lots of blushes or liquid blushes like that. I've got, you know, most of the Rare Beauty ones now. So um, I thought I'd try something a bit different and then i have wanted to try this for ages like years but this is the benefit cookie highlighter which again i have heard lots and lots of good things about it looks so pretty i had a little sneak peek before um but the packaging's like this so we've got our kind of retro style packaging and then this is the actual highlighter that is so pretty isn't it it's really nice do you know what i haven't gone for a kind of, like a champagne shade how beautiful is that it looks metallic for ages i've been going for more pinks 
oh that's so pretty it feels really fine as well you know like um doesn't feel like it's going to be glittery or chunky on the skin it feels really nice and kind of light and fine so again i'm going to put i'm going to do a first a first impression soon uh, for November and I'm going to chuck these all in with that then I picked up this Liz L cleanser I love a cleanser but um yeah this was on offer this was £14.40 so um the cleanse and polish hot cloth cleanser which yeah I mean this has been around for absolutely ages uh but yeah it was on offer so I thought I'd pick it up and give it a go but yeah, Lizelle products are really nice. I've, I've had, you know, gift sets for Christmases and things like that in the past. And yeah, always quite like them. It's just not a brand that I've kind of continued to purchase, but they are nice. And then very lastly, I thought I'd treat myself and went for this. So this is the Neom. Um, is that how you say it? Neom? Uh, Perfect Night Sleep bath foam english lavender chamomile and patchouli so it's very heavy so yeah how stunning is that packaging that would look so nice wouldn't it like on the side of your bath or whatever and it is weighty this is glass i'm definitely going to recycle this you know keep filling this up with other bubble bath when i finish with it <laughs> but yeah no this is lovely i think this cost me 22 or 24 pounds 22 i think um, but yeah how absolutely beautiful and there is 200 mil in here it's not one that I'm gonna gonna use like every time because you know that's quite pricey I am aware for a bubble bath but you know you have to treat yourself every now and then so there we go there is my little look fantastic haul um I probably do do some of these you know more often now because as I say I used to do them all the time but I just completely forgot I, I think I just skipped my mind and I concentrated on other things. Um, but yeah, obviously, if you like them, that is. But yeah, as always, I will link all the products in the description box below for you, along with a discount code as well. I do have a Look Fantastic discount code. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed watching. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up and I'd really appreciate it. I mean, the absolute world to me. If you did enjoy watching this video and you would like to see more content from me in the future and you would like to subscribe to my channel. Until then, thanks for watching. Bye.